Hello, fellow squeakers, and welcome back to another episode of Stardew Valley. It's going to be a beautiful day tomorrow. Today's luck is... Okay, a little extra luck. And living off the land. All right, so here's a reminder of the fish you can only find in summer. Dorado, rainbow trout, puffer fish, and octopus. Ooh, found in the mist during the... You know, I should probably go... I should probably go fishing for octopus. And maybe rainbow trout. Hmm. Ah, okay. Dear valued customer, thank you for visiting Pierre's and closes your cashback rewards program rebate. See you soon. P uh, Pierre, sorry for the stock message line. Enjoy. Why, thank you. All right, so we grabbed our flowers today. Um, let, let me, is, is it, you know, say, let me, let me, let me get my farming done here. We've got a lot. Stop, there we go. Get this stuff done and out of the way. Um, Okay. Radishes. Good. More coffee. Jeez, we got a lot of coffee. We're doing good for coffee. <laughs> I really wasn't expecting to quite so many... Uh, Quite such a, a huge crop of coffee. <laughs> I kind of just went crazy and was doing the the whole like no cabbage yet, and just kind of doing the whole like I don't know. Just seemed like a good idea at the time. <laughs> egg, egg, hello, egg, hello, 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 egg, hello, hello. We have one, two, three, four. Do we not have duck eggs today? I guess not. I guess they don't lay eggs every day. Makes sense. And there. Hello and milk. And hello and milk. And hello and milk. Oh. Thank you. You're doing a great job, Robin. Alright, so let's get these eggs turned into mayonnaise here. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, uh, we, we've got plenty of money to upgrade our animals and, uh, and such for when the, the barn is completed. <sighs> we need to turn in the, star, uh, the starfish today. And you know what? Um, barring anything else, I think I'm going to... No, I'm not going to do... Oh! Okay. Um... the radishes in there. Uh, radishes in there. Let's go ahead and put the gold coffee in there. Let's just go ahead and put all the coffee in there. Uh, what are we going to do for that? Um, <clears throat> oh, uh, I found out that... Here, let me put the gold radishes in there. I found out that... Um, Krobus, that that creepy-looking um, 
thing in the sewers likes horseradishes. <laughs> so I, I think I'll give him a, horse, uh, a horseradish today since I'm running around giving people stuff. Um, I could not find... I, I couldn't find out what Gus liked. So I guess I'm just going to end up giving Gus like a crocus or a daffodil or some sort of flower. Um, I'm sure there, there are things that he likes, but everything that he like, lo uh, all the things that he loves uh, are things that I don't really have the, uh, I, I don't have them. Um, I found out Maru likes batteries for some reason. Um, yeah, I, I'm... There's not really much you can say to that. Um, so let's just do these gold. Do I want gold? I think I just want normal strawberries for these. Uh, let's. Max, you need to... Max, you are... No. There we go. It's too bad we don't have any cabbage ready yet. I would really like to have some cabbage. Uh, because if I... If I had cabbage, I could make fish tacos. And it turns out, Gus does really love fish tacos. But since uh, since I don't have any cabbage, I don't have a way to make fish tacos. And so I'm kind of out of luck. What are you going to do? All right. Let's sell this strawberry jelly. Let's head into town. And let's at least get Gus taken care of with maybe a nice daffodil. Um, and I kind of feel bad because I usually try to do the loves. Err, my head. You know, I could go into, I, I could go to Oasis and give her, uh, uh, and give, um, give Sandy a flower too. You know what, I think I'm going to do that. And while I'm there, I can maybe buy some more... Maybe I should... Yeah, you know what? While I'm there, I think I'll buy some more star fruit. Uh, some more star fruit seeds. Do I? Um... No, I'm not going to do that. Uh, but what I will do... Let's, let's, let's give Pam this, this... That, that, that flower right there. Let's take a look at our low... Sandy Crob... Okay, so we need, we're, we're going to give Crobus that, that horseradish, because he likes it. I guess we'll give Kent and... Oh, Willie, you know, we really need to do something nice for Willie. Oh my gosh, you know what? I forgot I was going to go fishing today. I was going to go octopus fishing today. Well, I can squeeze in a couple of hours of octopus uh, octopus fishing. He's going to... Gus is going to be in there all day, so... He never leaves. Hey, Haley. Hello. Grab that. Grab that. Whoop. That. And we'll only be able to get in about an hour's uh, an hour of fishing or so, but maybe we'll be able to get an octopus. Maybe we'll get a couple. Or maybe we'll waste our time with a bunch of seaweed. Come on. 
on, let's show me some, <coughs> some octopus. Or show me garbage, you know, that's, that's fine too. Come on. Oop, this is kind of a spirited one here. Oh, oh, oh. Hopefully this is an octopus or something. Shit. Nice! I don't think I'm gonna get an octopus or anything. It's not super urgent that I get one, but it would have been nice. I guess I, guess I didn't think about it. Because I believe the, la uh, the octopus uh, only bite until 1 o'clock, so... Oh well, worth a try. Alright, uh, let's get that up there. Uh, let's... Let's turn in the starfish. Let's turn in... The other step. Oh. And let's go. Uh, let's go talk to. Oh, let's say hi to Haley. Hi, Haley. I should start reading some books instead of some magazines. It's good to learn things, isn't it? Yes, it is, Haley. I only ever look at the pictures. Well, Haley, you know, it broaden your horizons. There's nothing wrong with that. I mean, good for you for, for trying to expand your your horizons. That's really good. Hey, farmer guy, you look a little burnt. The more I practice this summer, the easier it'll be for me to go pro. Uh, then you'll be able to say you knew me once. Cool, huh? Sure. I wonder if I should... Nah. And let's turn in this starfish. Hey, pretty lady. Hey, kids. gonna give oh, what am I doing I'm like bypassing people I should be giving them gifts uh, I have not been keeping up with Carolyn or with uh, with Joe or with Jody oh goodness are you sure yes I am Wednesday's shop is closed keep that in mind if you need anything don't worry uh, and then Jody, thank you. This makes my day really special. Summer is nice, but it also means more work. I'll have to keep the garden in top shape. Yeah. Oh, here, dude. Hey, now this is a really great gift. Thanks. Hello, farmer. I've been gone so long, I feel like a stranger. Well, don't be a stranger now. <laughs> Let's go into the Star Drop Inn and let's give him a daffodil. Oh, oh! Hey, Maru. Oh, is that? Oh, wow, Lion, this is spectacular. What sort of gadget should I tinker with this summer? Well, you were talking about, oh. Thank you, I'm feeling a positive energy from this gift. Eating healthy is important, yes. <clears throat> We are... There you are! Hey, brother! What's going on? Hi there, lion. I'm, I'm glad to see you. You're always welcome here. Well, brother, happy birthday! You remembered my birthday! Thank you! This is great! How did we do? Well, at least we added a, a, a heart or two. Sorry, Gus. I, I, I feel like I'm, I'm letting you down. 
Al oh, you know what? Uh, I should probably talk to Alex and Elliot and George. Oh, and Sam and Willie and Dwarf. Jeez, I am just... I am not a good friend to these guys. Uh, here. Have a... Right? Good. Um... George? You're in here, right? Yeah, you usually are, so... Hey, George. Have a crocus. That's a terrible gift? Well, I'm... I'm, I'm sorry, George. It's a... It's a flower. I thought you would like a flower. Oh! Sam! Hey! How's it going? Sam! Have a crocus! I've already given him... Thanks, I really like this. I'm hungry. See you later. Okay. Hey, Leia. I found some wild fruits this morning. Sorry, I don't have any left. That's okay. Have a uh, daffodil. This is really nice. Thank you. I've already given you something. Oh, here we go. Pierre, I've got some uh, summer seeds available. You'd better stock up. Have a crocus. That's very kind of you. Thanks. No, I don't want to eat a crocus. Um. I don't. I don't see Abigail anywhere. It's Monday. I don't. Oh. Uh. What does he like? Can I give him a flower? I don't remember if he likes flowers or not. Uh, have a have a crocus. This is great, thanks. Hey, you're welcome. Hey, sorry if I came off rude when we first met. Don't worry about it, dude. Takes me a while to warm up to strangers. Oh, Harvey! No! Harvey! You... Already, okay, so I've already done all those. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh! Haley! Oh, hi! Uh, I just can't get this jar open. Uh, hey, Haley. Uh, hey, I'm here. I can help. Oh, it's you. Lion, right? Well, yeah, it's, it's me. We've talked many times. Say, you're pretty strong, aren't you? Uh, well, I, I would think so, yes. Great! Then you shouldn't have any problem opening this jar for me. Nope! Uh. Hey, you did it! You're stronger than you look! Uh, thank you. But she liked it. <laughs> Thanks. I guess that was the entire thing. I guess that was the entire thing. <laughs> I guess the cutscene is me opening... Oh, hey! Elliot! A gentle little sunbeam woke me up this morning. I've never felt so refreshed. He is quite the elegant little prissy guy, isn't he? Have a crocus. This is for me. Marvelous. Uh, all right, so let's go and... Oh! Wow! This is a day for cutscenes! What's going on, Sam? Sebastian? You doing good? Kind of jamming out to this music here. Oh! Didn't mean to interrupt, guys. Oh, hi, Lion. Sebastian and I were just having a little jam session. Yeah, this is for Sam. <clears throat> we're trying to start a band, but we still don't know what kind of music to make. There's too many possibilities. Say, Lion, what kind of music do you like? Hmm. Uh, we got cheerful pop music, experimental noise rock, High energy dance music and honky tonk country music. 
what, no, like, no, like, 80s heavy metal? I mean, damn, dude. I'm, I, I, I like my, I, I like my, you know, I, I like rock and roll, and I like 80s music, and I like, you know, heavy metal, and wh what the hell, man? None of these are, none of these are the stuff you like, or that I like. Well, cheerful pop music, experimental noise, high energy dance, and honky tonk country. Well, I guess if I had to pick the four, I mean, all of these. Are, I don't know about the experimental noise rock. I uh, that's. I mean, I guess that's okay. But high energy dance. I mean, I do like the dance music. I do like cheerful. I guess cheerful pop music. Let's just do cheerful pop music. Hey, you know what? That's exactly the kind of style I've been thinking about for the band. All right. What do you say, Sebastian? Should we do this? <laughs> I'm making Sebastian do cheerful pop music. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thanks for the help, Lion. With my guitar skills and Sebastian's wizardry on the synthesizer, we're going to be a screaming success. I'm convinced of it. Now I just need to find someone to play drums. I guess I can't say uh, can't talk to them right now. I guess I've already talked to them all that I'm going to be able to. So let's go down to the sewer and let's give a horseradish to Crovis there. I don't hardly spend any time with him and. He probably feels a little lonely down there, so we can at least make a, an attempt to be nice and, and civil. Oh, there's another. Hey, uh, Krobus! Krobus! Hey, brother. What's going on, man? Hey, look. Uh, I got this thing for you. And he loves it! This is an amazing gift for my people. It is a great honor to receive something like this. Well, I'm, I'm glad you like it. I could get a star drop. You know what? I'm getting a star drop. found a star drop. It's strange, but the taste reminds you of lions. <laughs> Maximum energy increased. Yes. Thank you, sir. I, I will catch you later. I will bring you back more, more wild horseradishes. Since you like those a lot. <sighs> Quiet night tonight. I wonder if, uh, I wonder what, uh, what Abigail's doing tonight. Oh, you're, you're just standing there. Okay, um, who all... Is in oh hey Gus oh hello there buddy I guess uh, I got friendly enough with him to have a cutscene with Gus <sighs> I'm just looking over last month's earnings it's not looking very good lion the worst thing and I hate to say this because she's my friend is Pam she hasn't paid off her tab in weeks but I can't ask her to do it. I know she'll get defensive, and I don't want to hurt her feelings. Lion, you gotta help me. Hey, Pam. Hey, uh, Gus, I'm awful thirsty if you catch my drift. Uh, well, uh, okay, Pam. 
Lion, what's going on here? Oh boy. You need to pay, pay your tab right now or the saloon isn't doing well financially. Well, that's a little rude. I guess it's a good idea to kind of broach the subject delicately. It isn't? That's terrible. Oh. Well, I guess I'd better pay off that tab then. Thanks, Pam. And thank you, Lion. Now let's get you that drink, Pam. Oh! Oh, and another cutscene! Oh, this one with Clint! Man, we're just having all sorts of uh, cutscenes right now. Hello, Lion. Care to join me? Let me just go ahead and tell you what's on my mind. Yeah, yeah. I have terrible luck with women, Lion. Well, dude, I'm a nice guy if you get to know me, I swear. Clint, dude, it's so obvious you like Emily. Okay, just go over there and say hello. Tell her you like her. Tell her you want to go out to, d uh, to, to dinner. Do something! The girls all like uh, seem to like you, Lion. Well, you know, I try to be friendly. Got any tips? Okay, impress, impress women with your strength and charm. Act crazy. Try to keep guess, uh, people guessing. Just act natural. Be yourself. Or treat women the same as men. Well, while I do say that you do need to treat women equally, treating women the same as men is really not right. Women are not men. You know, you try to be all, like, buddy-buddy guy kind of thing. I mean, yeah, some women will be cool with that, but yeah, and I, I don't think you're that kind of guy. Uh, impress women with your strength and charm. This is that egotistical, hey, man, hey, baby, how's it going? You know, look at my Lamborghini. This is why you should like me kind of guy. You know what? Uh-uh. Yeah, if you're that kind of guy, dude, you need to grow up. Uh, while some women will will go with that because, you know, because some women are attracted to that, dude, you're a shallow jerk and you need to chill. Act crazy to keep people guessing. Well, there's something to be said for humor. Uh, there's something to be said for people just, like, being silly and wild and crazy. And there's certainly a, a, a certain amount of... Of, of 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 charm to that, and I know a lot of women do like that. But honestly, eventually, dude, eventually you're gonna come down to yourself. You can try to be, you know, you definitely are probably you're definitely a strong guy. I mean, you're a blacksmith, of course you're a strong guy, and you have a certain level of charm when you aren't tripping over your own feet. But and, and you know, treating. You can act different ways all you want. When it all comes down to it, eventually you got to be you. And if you're living something other than being you, dude, that's the problem. I do act natural, but I never have any success. Well, dude, you need count. You need confidence, okay? Hi, Clint. What can I get for you tonight? I mean, come on, dude. Look, she's she's friendly. She's smiling. Ask her out. Yes. Uh, I mean, I'll have the big and cheesy with extra sauce, please. Hi, Lion. Hey, Emily. <clears throat> Thanks, Emily, for taking my order. See, dude. Uh, uh Emily, I was. I was wondering... Oh, come on, Clint. Come on, Clint. You can do this. You can do this. Come on! Yes, Clint? Come on, Clint. No! Clint! No, Clint! Tell her! Tell her! Hi, Shane. Here's your beverage. Thanks, Emily. Sir, so, how's your shift coming along? 
It's fine. Thanks for asking, Shane. Do you have any new chicken stories for me? She's just being polite, dude. I'm doomed. No, Clint. You're not doomed. Dude. Dude. Dude! Clint! Uh, be glad you're a farmer. It's nicer to work outdoors than by a hot furnace. I'll, I'll bet. I'm only a blacksmith because my father pushed me into it. Well, dude, you know, hey. Nothing says you have to stay that way. Uh, let's see, you're, I mean, I could give you a flower, but I have the feeling you'd be more of a, of a, like, oh, I could give you a geode. Eh, let's give you a flower. Uh, here, we've already talked to you. Where is Abigail? We, I think, we, yeah, we already said hello, uh, because we gave you your gift, so... And I think we're covered down on everybody else. Hmm. Wonder if Abigail's out and about tonight. It's 10.50, it's almost 11 o'clock. I know I'm kind of just wandering around. I don't really have a purpose. I know I, I just, I have one more thing to give and I just figured I'd... Maybe I, maybe I can give it to Sebastian or something if he's out here tonight. No, it doesn't look like he's out here tonight. Oh, I could uh, say hi to Linus, um, and I could give him a fish. Actually, no. Let's give him a berry. Hey, Linus. What's going on? During all these years, I've discovered a few secrets about life. You'll have to find out for yourself. Have a spice berry, brother. This is a great gift. Thank you. So, major... You know what? Let's just pop up here just in case it triggers a cutscene. No, it doesn't. Uh, major... Major cutscenes this episode. Major friend making this episode. It's getting late. We haven't run into... Uh, we haven't run into our lady love in a while. We're going to keep the cheese and the mayonnaise. Um, ooh. Oh, doggone it. That's what I wanted to do. Put that back on. <laughs> And good, 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 good. <clears throat> let's keep the the, uh, the regular mayonnaise. Let's sell uh, and let's keep the regular cheese. Put the rest in the refrigerator. Sell. So Wow, that's a... Look at that energy and health. Wow. And I get a lot of gold star cheese. Maybe... Uh, uh, I don't know. Put the... Let's sell the... Let, let's sell the gold star. Put them in. Okay, let's put... That in there. And let's put... Oh, wait. Oh, it wasn't this one. Uh, <laughs> that one. That one. That one. And we need copper, iron, wood. Copper, iron, Wood. Keg. Boom. We're not going to place this keg right now, but we will... Um, oh, wait. No. Um, maple syrup. Um, hmm. 
Mm. I know I'm like uh, I'm I'm being really like hesitant on 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 what to do, guys. I'm sorry. Um, uh, to be honest, I'm I'm kind of I'm I'm a little uncertain of myself right now. Um, I'm not gonna lie. I'm I'm a little flustered by this. I I and I. I realize how silly this is. It doesn't make any sense. Uh, you know, there's no reason for me to be flustered by by something as simple as I'm going to ask a a video game cartoon to marry me. But I am. <laughs> I'm flustered by it. I don't know why. It's so silly. Um, but I am genuinely a little flustered by. The, the fact that we're going to ask Abigail to marry us, and I can't seem to find her either, which is kind of throwing me off too. Um, let's go ahead and go to bed, uh, and we will call it an episode, and we, we will look at tomorrow as another day and another attempt. We'll see if we can find Abigail and Ask her, ask her to marry us. Uh, wow. Um, and uh, maybe tomorrow will be a good day for... Well, I, I suppose tomorrow might be a good day for doing the... Uh, for the, doing the Skull Cavern, actually. It might be. You know what? Um, before I run the next uh, the next next day, I think I'll look and see if there's anything special happening tomorrow. And if not, if something special happens, then uh, we you know then then I'll, then we'll we'll try to spend another day looking for Abigail and see if we can't ask her to marry us uh, <clears throat> to marry me. Uh, but if not, um, then we maybe we'll maybe tomorrow will be a good cavern day to go, and we'll just go do the cavern. But in any case, that's going to do it for this particular episode, everybody. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like. It helps me out so very much. For those of you who are regular viewers of mine, please make sure you're hitting that subscribe button and sharing my videos on your social media. I truly appreciate it when you do. And for those of you who already support me in all the ways that you do, you guys are freaking awesome. I love you guys. Keep it up. 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 And we will become great and powerful and we will rule the internet together. <laughs> oh. Uh, <clears throat> I can never get that, that that repressed entirely. Sorry. And as always, everyone, always remember that anyone can be a mouse that roars. But it takes someone special to be a lion that squeaks. So embrace your inner lion and squeak on!